Hey, how you doing? My name is Ray Clark, uh, natural body with a lifetime, drug-free bodybuilder. I'm from the great state of Florida, uh, specifically Maitland, Florida. And um, I'm excited to say that uh, coming off a win at Orlando Metropolitan Bodybuilding Championships, an overall win, and uh, won my class and won the overall, which, which I'm excited about. Uh, competing as, as a lifetime drug-free athlete, um, I love it. It's part of my calling in life, part of the, the gifts and talents and abilities that I've been blessed with. Uh, through my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. You can compare bodybuilding to, to anything in life, really. There, there are certain principles that, that you have to employ. There are certain principles like, you know, having vision. You know, you got to know where you're going. Vision is very important. You know, without a vision, people perish. So you have to have that vision. Um, along with vision, you, you got to have, you got to have purpose. You got to know your purpose as to why you're doing what you're doing. Um, you got to have vision. You got to have purpose. And you, you got to have a, a tenacity, you know. One thing, one thing I'm proud to say, and I, I'm not afraid to admit it, I'm, I'm a tenacious person. I am a tenacious person. I've been that way since I was a little kid playing sports. I am tenacious. I want to win. I want to do whatever it takes within the confines of the rules to win. So if that means practicing a little bit harder, if it means running a little bit longer, if that means uh, standing a little later in the gym, if that means going a little heavier when I feel tired in the gym, I'm going to do it. I want to come in, I want to dominate, you know, I want to come in, I want to dominate, I want to conquer. That's my mentality, man, I have, I have that mentality. One of my favorite sayings is preparation precedes promotion. You know, if you want to be promoted, you got to be prepared, and uh, preparation is everything. When it comes to achieving that, the, the, the body you want, you have the vision, now you have to take the necessary steps. And uh, when it comes to that, uh, it's just like an artist. You know, I think of an artist who, who has a paintbrush, and in his mind, he has something he wants to create. In his mind, he has something he, he's envision, he's, he's visualizing something in mind he wants to do. And uh, he has a blank canvas. And bodybuilding is kind of the same way. When it comes to your body, you have like this blank canvas, and and, and just like the artist holds his paintbrush in his hands, and he begins to create. And, and for bystanders or those watching him begin to create, you, you can't really see anything. But the artist knows deep down inside what he's trying to do, what his ultimate objective is. The Bible is the same way. Um, instead of using a paintbrush, we use food. You know, we use food. We use nutrition. You know, with that nutrition, you can begin to sculpt the kind of body that you want. With the proper training, the proper resistance training, uh, proper, proper cardio, intense cardio. You know, all that goes into play when it comes to sculpting that body that, that you desire. It all works hand in hand. And at the end of the day, when, that, when you have that date set as, as to what particular show you have down on the calendar, you know that when that day comes, because you prepared, because you, you, have, you have taken the necessary steps, you have, you have done everything you know to do, that on that day you know you're going to be successful. And on that day you know you're going to present the best you you can present. That's truly what bodybuilding is all about. That, that's what it takes to be a successful bodybuilder. Taking all those necessary steps and, and, and implementing them and uh, achieving that end goal, which is stepping on a bodybuilding stage and allowing everyone to see what you've been working hard on, what you've been sacrificing for, what you've been sweating over, what you've been, what you've been bleeding for. That, that's the that's step on that stage. Not only step on that stage, but leave that stage as a champion because that's always my goal. I want to leave a champion. I like winning. For those of you who ever won anything in your life, winning is fun. Winning is good. We love winning. You have some in your heart, pursue it with everything you have. Pursue it. Uh, don't look back. Uh, keep pursuing and keep pursuing it until you obtain that prize. It's kind of like getting ready for a bodybuilding show. You got to prepare when you get ready for a bodybuilding show. You got to have vision. Uh, you got to know where you're going. My end goal is just to, uh, to, to inspire and, and to, to motivate uh, individuals to pursue your dream, to pursue your calling, to pursue that which God has placed in your heart, and to pursue it, to be relentless at it, uh, to, be, to be relentless and, and, and to have the tenacity and uh, don't let obstacles and don't allow people and don't let uh, the self-limiting uh, voices try to stop you or hold you back from achieving what's in your heart.